Start over on the YouTube side before I forget. Hope everyone's doing well today. Um, we are back with Pokemon Sword and Sh It's been over a year, and I'm still accidentally saying Sword and Shield sometimes. Scarlet and Violet. I don't I don't know why I said Sword and Shield. I've legit not played that game in forever. Alright, let me quickly do this. There we go. I, 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 I genuinely don't know what happened there. My brain just decided to not work. Uh, today is mostly going to be doing ladder climbing, but viewer battles, I am leaving like an option just in case, because I know obviously you guys like doing some battles here and there. Uh, nothing's changed. I also want to see what Pokemon I have for uh, shiny hunting today. Because I'm going to be doing that in my own time, probably during work. And so far, there is legit nothing I care about. Cool. Outside of the Geodude, I mean, having a shiny golem's nice. I mean, that, it's just gold. It's like the most simple shiny, but it's nice. You know, it's, it's, it's not bad. A new season started. Uh, we didn't get to Master Ball in time. We were close. We were very close. Uh, we did end with uh, ult uh, Ultra Ball tier. So at least we got some, you know, Harba Mystica, which, hey, we'll take. You look like a shiny? Damn, I don't know how to take that, man. Should I take that as a compliment or should I be offended? Also, how you doing, Shulk? <sighs> God, my eye. Ugh. My eyes for a moment decided to have them legit just, uh, see? Lovely, hell yeah. Alright. New season story, let's get to grinding. Amoongus, Fluttermane, Iron Hands, Roaring Moon, Arcanine, and Chiyu. I see several Pokemon that go down to World Quaker. A lot of Pokemon, actually. Like, quite a bit. Like, a, like a lot, a lot. Like, like l l most of them. Most of them go down to... Ch most of them go down to World Quaker. Fair enough. Fair enough, Shulk. I mean, hey, you made to the... You, you, you're almost to the weekend. And I'd say that's pretty rad. I would say that's pretty cool. I mean, I literally just woke up this morning, tried to find food, did not find food, and here we are. Hell yeah, dude. Hell yeah. I already have a very basic idea of what's about to happen. I think the Roaring Moon protects, and I get a free Trick Room up. The issue is what happens after the Trick Room. But I don't really feel like dealing with the Amoongus. I know Cresselia will live, which is the main thing. Because I kind of need her to live. Because then we get to do this. Hey, Mew, how you doing? Among Us, it's Amoongus, you silly goober. You silly billy. Ya silly guy? Also, how you doing, Mew? I'm good, tired, but okay. Hey, valid AF, my dude. Valid AF. Happens to the best of us. I can say I feel you on the tired part. I do feel you there. Oh, but I'm glad I, I hey, you know what happens I happens man I'm gonna do this I'm gonna stay in, keep in iron hands I'm gonna try and get some heavy slams up and I'm just gonna go for protect I want to see if I can if I can get my iron hands up I do feel you on the tired part. I ran out of, like, ice for my iced coffee, and it made me sad. So I didn't really get coffee this morning. I'll probably get coffee on my way to work. 
I was very upset of Spaghetto, though. I can tell you that much. Hey, Joker. There are several things I think this could be about. What's up? There are several things I think this could be. I brew my own. God, I wish I was that cool. I wish I was that cool. I'm fortunately not that cool. <laughs> You're a twink and party animals are coming to PlayStation? Uh, I mean, I don't care about party animals, but I can tell you I'm not a twink. I can tell you that's a lie. I mean, fair enough. Fair enough. That That's valid. Also, ow. That hurt. That very much hurt. I think at plus one, I should at least do enough damage. Iron Hands is kind of like my backup, man. Hi, Red King. Hi, Kennedy. Thanks for not caring about the game. I, I, I don't know anything about Party Animal. I'm sorry, man. I, I don't know nothing. I have no emotional attachment. I'm sorry, man. It does. It comes out in two weeks. I'm very excited. I'm very excited. I'm very excited. Like, severely excited. Extremely, some would say. I, I, I'm just, I'm just very excited. <laughs> Twisted becomes normal. That's A-OK -okay with me. Because the main thing is Roaring Moon no longer has his boost. Speaking of Roaring Moon, hello there. Hmm. Who do you have in the back? All fast options. I mean, fair enough. I I I'm I'm I was I was I would say overall I'm pretty satisfied with the teal mask. I think for what it is, I got, I got like my, my, I, I, I got what I wanted out of it. Yeah, they, the Street Fighter uh, added a bunch of stuff today. One of which uh, was $10 costumes, which makes me depressed. Like, I shit you not, a good chunk of their, their, like the out, the, the third outfits are like $10. Like every, all the third outfits are $10. And that just makes me sad. That that just makes me sad, you know? Cause you know, I was I was pretty excited for the third outfits. Alright, Fluttermane or Chiyu, which one? Oh, Arcanine, that also works. No no, this this is fine. This is fine. This is more than fine, actually. Two drain punts on uh, Arcanine should one-shot it. Well, not one-shot it, but two-shot it. This should be good. Because we also have access to Will-O-Wisp, which is huge. Yeah, I, I very much got sad the second I saw the fact that they were that expensive. Like, I legit went, oh. Like, I was genuinely sad. Like, genuinely sad. Because I was looking forward to the outfits as well, and I'm like, oh. Well, that sucks. Yeah, no, I, I, was, I was just genuinely sad, to be honest. Guarantee he's probably going to go for, like, Flare Blitz. Oh, Extreme Speed. Oh, you're just trying to get rid of Iron Hands. I mean, fair enough, I guess. I still have plenty of Drain Punch sources. Like, his Iron Hands is there. 
His Iron Hands is minus one and burnt. All right, he doesn't win this fight. My Iron Hands wins the fight. Though at the same time, he has yet to use Terra. Meaning, most likely, I am going to go for Rock Slide. Hmm. I'm going to go for Rock Slide. Drain Punch. I guarantee it's going to be Terra Flying, which if that's the case, obviously, we, we have Rock Slide. Hey, man, I'm glad to hear you're enjoying it in that case, Kennedy. That's awesome. It's always a good time when you he when you hear peeps are enjoying a game, you know? That's unfortunate. Though Iron Hands should live in acrobatics. Keyword is should. Hi, Blade. Like, if we lose this one, it's fine. No big deal. But in theory, we should be fine. How you doing, Blade? We should be tanky enough to live in acrobatics, hopefully. I got a shiny bundle. Oh, hell yeah, dude. That's awesome. Yeah, and there's no way we lose to the Iron Hands in the Drain Punch fight. As long as I kill the Roaring Moon here, and then I just start hitting the Iron Bun like the Iron Hands with Drain Punches, I'm fine. Knock it out. All right, now I just need to live the Drain Punch battle. Which is a little scarier than I thought it was originally going to be. Ah, shit. Damn, I was hoping for a low roll. I was hoping for a low roll. Tragic. There's like one bundle set. Well, okay, I'm technically lying. But the, the set is max speed, max special attack, timid nature, booster energy, freeze dry, icy wind, hydro pump protect. I have seen them get rid of, uh, I have seen them replace hydro pump with encore before, and that was funny. Which gen had the best gym music? Uh, eight. What about physical bundle? You're a dumbass, but I mean, you could run it if you want. <laughs> hey, oh, my debit card came in today. Oh, hell yeah, dude. Congrats. Congrats on the card, man. Okay, Chien Pao Dragon Eye. I have a question. How do I use it? Uh, You type in the, the numbers on the front, the date, the, the, the three numbers on the back. And then your zip code. That's how you use it. I'm back lurking again, uh, again while at work. Good luck. Thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you. I appreciate the lurks. All lurks are appreciated. I'm thinking Chien Pal Dragonite is like their best lead. Yeah, it's probably, it's probably that. Which, if that's the case... Hiner Focus Protect... So, how do you want to use it if you want to purchase something online? I mean, they'll just ask for your card info. It's pretty much what it just is. They'll just ask for it. And you just give it. Yo! Doctor, the children are coming. Agma! Turn on my cringe inhibitors. Thank you for the raid, and thank you for the follow. Hello, hello. Welcome, everyone. Agma, happy birthday. Chat, everyone say happy birthday to Agma. Because it is Agma's birthday today. Can we get a shout out to Agma? Your cringe inhibitors are too weak against me. My cringe inhibitors are always strong enough. 
That's all they need to be. How you doing, Agma? I hope your stream was good. How's your birthday so far? Of course, JoJo music. I'm a JoJo fan. I've got to have JoJo music. Is my shoutouts not on? I have shoutouts. I don't know why it didn't work. It might be down. I'm not sure. Oh, fuck. Okay, if I Terra Water... Ugh, that's a waste of Terra. You know what? It's fine. I will protect... I will protect next turn. But welcome, everyone. Shoutouts have been breaking a lot for people recently. Okay, so it's not just a me thing. But thank you so much. For those who are unaware, Agma is... Uh, obviously, uh, EQ member, uh, she is actually Roddy's mom, uh, it's still funny saying that, uh, she's awesome, and if you don't follow her, you should go do that, she's amazing. Pseudo Wudo Supremacy, valid AF, Pseudo Wudo's a funny guy. He's a funny man. I think, if I go for another... I love you too, Agma. Thank you so much. What do you have in the back? Hold on. I gotta double check. Jin Pao Roaring Moon. Oh, okay. So I just benefit from terroring. Cool. I, I, I gain literally everything by clicking this button. Hey, that's, that's super valid. The guy respect the pseudo wudo pick. I just like it when people say they like a very obscure Pokemon. I think I think it's a cool bond, you know? Cause it's like, oh, you know, not a lot of people will just say like, oh, this is my favorite Pokemon or something. I just think that's neat, you know? I just think it's I just think it's neat. I mean I'm a bear a bear tick's my boy, so. Bear tick's my guy. I, I just think he's rad. <laughs> oh. So so true, Shulk. Who the hell's emote is that? Whoever's the emote that is, that's funny. Baratick is pretty rad. He's my guy. He's my boy. I love him. Ah, there, Goldingo. Hell yeah. I just hope he evolves one day. That's my main thing. I do hope one day they finally give him the evolution he deserves. The main thing I'm, um... The main thing I'm processing through my head right now, right? Do I outspeed... Do I outspeed this Goldango? Can I weaken... You know, the... Obviously, the Roaring Moon right there. Because as long as I start weakening weakening the Roaring Moon, I should be fine. Oh, yeah. That's a great example, dude. Togekiss is awesome. That sucks. Trick. Oh my god, you fucked up. Oh, you're, you are screwed, buddy. Oh, you are screwed. Oh, you fucked up. Oh, you fucked up. Choice Scarf. He tricked me, Choice Scarf. Oh, this dude is fucked. Choice Scarf is an item that makes that gives you a speed boost. He tricked on a Choice Scarf onto an Arcanine. I'm locked in the Flare Blitz, but like... There's no downside to that. There is no downside to this. 
Especially when I have this guy in the back. And especially when my final Pokemon is called an Iron Bundle. My dude choice scarfed an Arcanine. Oh, that is tragic. Oh, that is the most tragic thing I've ever seen in my life. Because I literally have Iron Bundle in the back. There's no way he wins this. Hisui and Arcanine is awesome. I think Hisui and Arcanine is super fucking cool. Like, obviously, I would have loved to have a Water-type Arcanine, but for what we got, I, I, I'm a big fan. I'm a big fan. I mean, it's very funny because, like, obviously, when Arcanine, like, when they first showed off Hisui and Arcanine, everyone in, like, the VGC community is like, oh, this guy's gonna be kind of mid. He'll only be Rocky Helmet. And then they realized, hey, wait a moment. Choi wait a moment. Stab, stab, rock slide? Stab, rock slide? Stab, rock slide? Stab, rock slide is kind of cool. Stab, rock slide is kind of sexy. If you think about it. And then lo and behold, you know, they find out Stab Rock Slide is uh, really good. Especially in a generation where you could swap your type. Me spamming Stab Rock Slide. It is! Rock, rock Slide flinches are the bane of anyone's existence. I would know, that would be my existence half the time. <laughs> I would very much know. I mean, it's the reason why it's, like, one of the best VGC moves is because that flinch chance. That's, like, literally, like, game-changing right there. Hey, I'll use Aurora Veil? I don't feel like it. Not yet. I don't have my, I don't have my proper snow team ready. Oh, hey, there's your, there's your Aurora Veil. Uh, Obama Snow... This is just a regulation... This is a fucking regulation A team. My dude's just running regulation A. But now it's literally the question of what is he starting with? Because he's either going to start Armor Rouge... Like, there's a good chance he starts Armor Rouge. Honestly, now thinking about it, Armor Rouge is like his best bet. I mean, you know, it's right there. Also, Don Dozo scares me. After dealing, like losing to a Dozo team last time, I'm bringing these guys in the back. I think I'm just going to start with Torterra Cresselia. Like, it's very much just what are they leading with? They have their team is literally just three combos. There's a reason Tatsugiri's and Ubers was Tatsugiri and Ubers mon. If that's the case, that's funny. Okay, I should probably swap out Torterra. Because that Glaceon... Because Commander... Are we talking Smogon singles? I mean, like, are we talking Smogon Ubers? What? Wait, I, I'm suddenly confused. Are we talking Smogon? Smogon double Ubers? God, I keep forgetting Smog. Why does anyone play Smogon doubles? Just play VGC. Also, hi, Winter. How are you? Blissy. So true. Like, my brain is confused by the fact that there's people that will actually play that. 
Also, Lamau. Like, my brain is like, huh. Cramping you winning? I'm trying. I'm trying to. I, I, I'm sorry to hear you're cramping, Winter. I hope you do feel better. Terra Water? Okay. Uh, that's fine. I wasn't even going for you, so that's, that, that's A-OK. -okay. That's okay. That's A-OK -okay with me, Chief. But I'm very sorry you're feeling that way, Winter. I do hope you feel better. I will say I'm terrified. I'm terrified of the potential for of um what's the move oh no not move i'm terrified of the chance for freeze the freeze chance is what scares me the most Like, that, that freeze chance is just looming there, and that scares me. Well, that's good at the very least. I am glad it, it, it is starting to go down for you. That is, that is good to hear at the very least, Winter. Okay, here's the scary part. I can't click Earthquake. Like, I... I cannot click Earthquake. Otherwise, I'm condemning both of my Pokemon in the back. Torterra is a fantastic design. I love Torterra. Okay, it's in DD Armor Rouge. That's the one I was kind of worried about. This was the one I was kind of worried about. And kinda is a little bit of an understatement. Ah, fuck. Ah, fuck. Ugh. I'm just going to go for Earthquake. There's no other option I have here. That Armor Rouge is just a threat. I mean, it, it like, like, I mean, I'm not competing. Also, that sucks because that mostly likely means we lose unless Arcanine clutches it out. Um, I'm not competing myself. I am commentating. Like I, I I have I've been asked this a few times. I I am not competing. I am commentating. And I am giving people that are less experienced first choice in the draft. Yeah, no, I'm not I'm not competing. <laughs> I'm not competing. I'm commentating. I'm scared of Songo then. Songo so, Songo knows basics, but she's actually not, like, super scary. Like, Songo... Like, the main thing Songo, what I've gathered, is the lack of team building. Is the main thing I've noticed with Songo. Which is fine, you know? It is something that you just learn. I want baby team. I'm gonna make the baby team. I mean, fair enough. Fair enough. I'm going to hope I outspeed Armor Rouge. I'm pretty sure I do. And I'm going to hope that this thing does not miss. If we miss, I'm fucked. I am hoping I outspeed. Come on. Follow me? Doesn't matter. I just need to outspeed. I just need to outspeed. Rock slide, come on. Yes! Oh, let's go. Oh, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. 
get fucked. Anyway. Anyway. We do love a little bit of rage quits. We do, we do love a little bit of rage quitting. Sorry, I get really, I get really pumped up when it's clutch. And, you know, that happens. We do love a rage quit. By the way, chat. Uh, uh one thing I do want to discuss was yesterday. <laughs> yesterday, I, <laughs> yesterday was so funny. So, for context, for those who don't follow me on Twitter or are not active in the Discord, which, by the way, if you're not in the Discord, join. It's the EQ Discord. Um, but one of the things that happened yesterday is I decided to announce that Human Hail, like, now that I am, uh, you know, going by she, her, uh, and I haven't really designed the, the Femme Human Hail in a long time, I decided I would make... Fem human hail into a short stack like a, a, a very bottom heavy short stack and I've never gotten so many like replies and uh like DMs over something in a long time it was really funny I don't have a design yet but pretty much what I'm going for when I eventually do get around to it is uh a uh, pudgy body type, four foot seven, and primarily very bottom heavy. So a lot, a lot of it isn't like in the legs. Cause I thought it would be very funny. Because for those who are unaware, uh, the mermaid design here canonically thirteen feet tall. So I just thought it would be funny. Also, hi star, how you doing? Also, I'm scared. Uh, I decided yesterday uh, I would announce that Fem Hail would canonically be a short stack. So, like, the human hail, not this one, but, like, the human design would canonically be a, uh, a short stack. Hey, Ben. So, in lore, what I'm going with now is when I, like, I'm primarily a mermaid in lore. Always going to be primarily a mermaid. And, uh, the mermaid, what you're looking at, 13 feet tall. 13 feet. When she's in human form, uh, she, she's, uh, 4 foot 7. <laughs> I just thought that'd be funny and cute, alright? Sue me. Sue me. <laughs> oh, pheasantipity. How tall is Paul? Uh, don't worry about it. I don't have a size yet. I need to figure it out. I need to pretty much look at, uh, comparison. Hey, that's awesome. She ate a mushroom. She ate, like, the little, like, blue mini mushroom when going into human form. But because she's already so big, uh, she just, she became small. And, like, all of, like, the tail mass just went to her legs. <laughs> what? Oh, nice, Ben. I astral chain is something that's been on my list, but I haven't looked into myself. But nice. But yeah, no, I fe fem hail is uh, yeah, no, she's got a, a a pretty like pudgy body type. Like you know, there's there her her tummy is no like noticeable. Pretty much. And, uh, all, like, massive legs. That's what I'm going for. I haven't just, uh, yeah, she's plus size. She's very much plus size. <laughs> that would be funny to see. That would be funny to see, Star. But yes, uh, Fem Hail would be plus size is the best way to describe her. <laughs> oh? Who, who would the artist be, Winter? If you don't mind me asking. Hello, Fezendipity.
Protect. Lamau. Heavy slam onto Arcanine. That's not too bad. It could have been worse. I know Pheasantipity is Poison Fairy. So if I do this, because yeah, no, I I need to. I don't have the money right now, but I very much send you a link, then draw my version of Human Fem Hail. Ooh, I I am genuinely curious to see what you come up with, Winter. I'm very curious because if you do want the description is on my Twitter if you want to check it out Because yeah, no, I haven't designed her yet And I'm very excited yesterday. I felt so bad for crowding people's timelines but like My friend are like my friend Aria put it best. I'm kind of in like the quote-unquote puberty Sage, how did Hailstone get into Pokemon? Oh, uh, my sister, my older sister introduced it to me. She was she she's not a Pokemon person, but she did introduce me to Pokemon. Uh, back when I was in uh, second grade, second grade is about the time when I got into it. Pokemon Platinum was my first game. Second grade, I could not read. I straight up could not read in second grade. Meaning, I played a Pokemon game without, uh, without knowing how to read. That's a fun thought. Your sister is a canon event, and I'll forever be thankful. Because, like, I will always obviously have fixations. Like, everyone has a hyper fixation here and there. It's normal. But for, like, Pokemon has always just been the thing that I've just really enjoyed, you know? I've always loved Pokemon. Like, throughout most of my life, I have always loved Pokemon. Uh, no. I never actually beat Platinum. Believe it or not, I've never beaten Platinum. Like, Pokemon Platinum is the Pokemon game I still have yet to ever beat. I have always- I always got to Cynthia, but I never beat her as a kid. So maybe one day I'll actually get around to fighting her. No, I, I never beat... I did beat Heart Gold. That was my second Pokemon game, and I did beat that. But I never beat Platinum. And obviously, going forward, I did, like... You know... I did beat Pokemon games going forward, but uh, Platinum is just the game I've never beaten. Maybe one day, you know? Maybe one day. All right, he's not Throat Spray. That's good to know. Thank you for the stretch. Ugh. Thank you for the stretch. Why are you going for two clangorous souls? This dude is just being greedy AF. True. I mean, that was the go-to as a kid. If you if your move didn't like do damage, you got rid of it. That shit was gone. Like that was out of there. That was nah, not doing it, chief. Yeah, this dude's being very greedy. Like extremely. Though I'm pretty sure I will at least outspeed with Iron Bundle. You should make a TTS redeem. I mean, I do have TTS with bits, but I don't have a TTS redeem at the moment. Maybe at some point I will, but at least at the moment, it's just uh, for bits. I do want to get rid of Ogapon. Was this man cooking? I mean, he got two double Omni boosts, so like, he's pretty strong. Oh, this is fine in that case. Bro, you just gave me the win. You just... Okay, this guy just fucked up. 
I'm pretty sure Clank, like, he had the chance of possibly outspeeding. He fucked up. My, my dude just fucked up. That's funny. That's funny. Gonna type in Nathan Drake's Subway commercial in the TTS? I forgot that happened. Oh my god, I forgot that happened. That's funny. God, I forgot that happened. Their name is Sander. It's not Sandler. It is Sander, but not Sandler. Oh my god. I, I, at least uh, I've been escaping Adam Sandler for now, okay? That's all that matters, is the fact that I've been able to escape Sandler. I just, I forgot that genuinely happened that Nathan Drake was in a Subway way commercial. That was funny. Footlong cookie, am I right? True. The footlong cookie. I am very excited for that. Also, hello there, Alex. Cleavor, Fluttermane, Rillaboom, Hisuian Arcanine. Uh, hold on, my phone. Okay, my <gasps> phone had a moment. Iron Hands and Gold Dango. Um, I think my best option for this, right? Hmm. I think it is Gold Dango Iron Hands again. Like, Earthquake would be so nice. Earthquake would be nice. Fuck. Earthquake would be so nice. Man, Earthquake would be awesome. Maybe I'd go for Earthquake. I don't know, Chief. <laughs> Maybe I do go for Earthquake. Ordering two foot long cookies. Smear Nutella between them, calling that shit diabetes. And they wonder why America has a uh, an obesity problem. I mean, I'm going to order it either way. I'm just saying, you know, I'll order it. I mean, I'm, I'm probably going to order that shit. It's just, you know. Yeah. What's up, Star? Shulk, you need to... That, that, that sounds delicious, but God, I can feel, like, the fat in that. Like, holy crap. That sounds delicious. But God, that would kill me if I ate it. Oh, they went for the kill. Oh, they wanted to kill. Sign language. It would be sign language. American ASL, specifically. Mostly just because I have a uh, friend. I, I, have, I, have a, I have a good friend who um, is mute that I wish to communicate with more. Um... So, yeah. Hello there, Big Jimbo. How you doing? And I'm doing pretty good. Right now, we're just playing some Pokemon, all that good stuff. How are you doing? Hey, Rubia, how you doing? What's my play here? Oh, yeah, you're Terra Bug. That's right. I think I got a free Nasty plot off, to be honest. Oh, please tell me you swapped in the Flutterman. Is that Flutterman? Ah, dude, it would have been so nice if it was Flutterman. 
That would have been so nice. I mean, we eat that. Okay, we don't eat that as well as I thought. How's that a shiny? Um, Gold Dango's shiny is the shiny of all time. I don't know what to tell you, Chief. It is the shiny of all time. Just woke up from my nap. Valid, valid. Very valid. I'm going to Terra Water just so I live a Gold Dango Shadow Ball. That's probably my best bet. Yeah, I think it's my best bet. That's valid, Star. But you know, for me, if I had to learn any language fluently, it would be ASL. At least for me. No! Shit! I thought I lived! Damn! That sucks! That sucks big time! That is big tragic. They were not a fan of my... They were not a fan of my Goldengo. Uh, American Sign Language, Jimbo. That's what ASL stands for. Gonna write Among Us in Japanese. Among Us. Icy Lobby? Oh, I see. I see. Trust me. I, I, I got Icy Lobby open. I always see everything posted in there in streams. Again, I appreciate y'all sending it to Icy Lobby and not my DMs anymore. I very much appreciate. Would you eat it? Nah. Mostly just because that looks like it would kill me. Hey, Spaghetti. Just doing some ladder climbing. New season started today. Last season of Regulation E. And then we're going to Regulation F, which is just really funny. <laughs> really funny saying. Yeah, so next season's Regulation F. Oh, hello there, Mama. Hope you're doing well. You have Ice Punch? Bruh. Shit. Oh, that's GG. Yeah, that's GG. I don't think there's any way I win with Cresselia. Shit, I don't think I win with Cresselia and Iron Hands. Yeah, there's no way I win this. Shit, that sucks. Unless Cresselia lives? First timer, hey, welcome to the channel. My name is Hailstone. I'm a lumpfish VTuber. How you doing? Hmm. I gotta get rid of Gold Dingo. I like desperately need to get rid of Gold Dingo. I'm doing good right now, just playing some Pokemon VGC. In hopes of getting the Master Ball rank this time around, since I was close to last season. Because it's been a hot second since I've been in the Master Ball. I was close last season, but it just didn't, you know, didn't work out. Mostly in the fact that I just kind of forgot to grind the last second to get into Master Ball. It was very much doable. I was just kind of lazy. <laughs> it was very much doable. I'm sick. I'm very sorry to hear spaghetti. I do hope you feel better. Ugh. Hello there, Cleavor. Shit, I can't drain punch you? Ah, shit. Yeah, I'm not winning this. Unless I get, like, the most well-timed, like, drain punches out there. Their iron hands is just gonna get me, so. Yeah, that's GG. 
Well, if I'm going down, I might as well take myself out. It is what it is, you know? It is what it is. Ugh, Lord. Mm. I need coffee. I swear, as soon as I start heading to work today, I'm getting coffee on my way back. Because, good God. Like, my eyes are just like... Ugh. I also kind of need to shave today, but I kind of forgot, to be honest. To be a little honest, I kind of forgot. How's life? I'd say pretty good. Still waiting for, um, you know, still waiting to hear back from a new job that I applied for, but hey, at the very least, uh, it's not a no, which I've been very much told it's not a no. I'm just waiting. Hailstone grow a beard? No, I look bad with facial hair. I don't like having facial hair. Very much not in my uh, my plans at the moment. Iron Hands, Amoongus, Iron Bundle, Grimmsnarl, Gyarados, and Dragonite. Iron Bundle lead would be so nice, but at the same time, I'm scared of the bundle lead. Because leading bundle is such a big risk, especially when they got an Iron Hands, right? But at the same time, Gold Dingo, Iron Bundle, lead could be some nasty, nasty stuff. Hailstone and Mutton Chops? i rather do a beard than Mutton Chops. Oh my god. I only know one person with Mutton Chops. Well, that had mustin Mutton Chops. That'd be Eagle Orb at one point. He had mustin Mutton char uh, Chops for a while. And it, it I, he was the only person that, like... Made it look decent. Meanwhile, if I tried, it'd be shit. And I'm not going to. Because, again, try I'm trying to look more androgyn androgynous IRL. At least at the moment. Until I'm able to get in my own situation where I can look the way I want. Also, sounds good, Shulk. Today, I'm only probably going to be doing one battle per viewer. Just because of the fact that, um... I am primarily doing ladder climbing, and yo! Thank you, White, for the two months. Let's go! Start of the subscriber streak, but accidentally broke my view streak RIP. Ah, it happens. It happens to the best of us. How you doing today? How you doing? I'm going to protect Iron Bundle. I'm going to go for a nasty plot. Went to the dentist today. Had like a four-hour nap afterwards. Valid. Very valid. Yo, Ruby with the four months. Let's go. We are so close to getting a hype train started. Yes. What's two plus two? Uh, yes. How you doing, Zane? Oh, boy. Fair enough, T. I hope everything works out. Also, nice to see you again, my dude. Yo, chat, if we get a hype drain started, I will cry. I... Ow! Train? Like in Pokemon? <laughs> like in Pokemon. Oh, my God. Thank you for the biddies, White. I will cry. Oh. Uh, don't worry about it. How you doing, Zane? I'm just being goofy. No, you're alive! No! You're alive! You weren't supposed to live! Shit! Um... 
The answer is yes, T. Give it time. Give it time. Shit. Okay. Uh, that's fine. In theory? In theory? In theory? What's your favorite Paradox Pokemon? Oh, shit. I would say my favorite Paradox is probably... Shit, what would it be? I would say my favorite Paradox is probably Iron Valiant. I'm just a big fan of how it looks. Also, welcome back, Winter. I got your recommendation. I will totally commission them when I get the money because, you know, I don't have the money at the moment. But I very much appreciate the recommendation. I will definitely be commissioning them when I get the money. Yeah, Iron Valley is sick. Can't wait for a second set of Iron Wake and Iron Leaves. True. I am very excited for Walking Wake to be legal. That is something I'm looking forward to. I love their art. Wish I had the money. Yeah, that's that's me. That's literally me. Like, I love how their art style looks. I just don't have the money right now, and it makes me sad. It's currently not legal, no. Not currently. It will be legal, uh, probably Regulation F is what I would assume. Gallade's my favorite Pokemon? Valid. That's, that's base. That's base as hell. I respect, I respect it. I res I respect the Gallade pick. Mine's Bear Tick. But, you know, thank you, Winter. Uh, I, I am just, I, I, I am... I'm sorry if I sound stuttery. I'm still just very much uh, in the anxiety-filled phase of, you know, when I talk about femme stuff on stream. I get, like, a very... Like, I feel anxious. Doctor! The children are coming! Big Turn Yellow, on, like, what the fuck? Images. You are going to make me cry. What the fuck, dude? Mods, can we get a shout out? Yellow, how you doing? Oh my god, you are going to make me cry. Hello there, Royal Bunny. I I'll do the shout out. Oh my god, dude, you are actually going to make me cry. Oh. Was playing Peggle, it was great. Hell yeah, I'm so happy. Search history to hear. is just top surgery. Okay. And voice feminize For voice those who are unaware, uh, Big Yellow. She, like, her search history is, is just over and over again. Uh, tube surgery. One of my favorite YouTubers. It just YouTubers. says tube surgery over and over. I love Big That's Yellow's her videos. Search history. Peggle, is, Peggle is so good. Strongest, Peggle, Peggle really is such strong. a silly game. It's so silly. But Big Yellow is one of my favorite YouTubers of all time. And uh, yeah, I, I don't I don't know I don't know how how we got to talking as much as I do, but I'm very thankful. I hope you're doing well and thank you so much for the raid, holy shit. That <laughs> my heart <laughs> My heart is racing right now. Thank you so much. It'd be funny if Chatot's chatter allows recording of customized audio. Dude, there's a reason why Chatter got changed and was banned for so long. Bro really was te people were really teaching Chatot slurs. Oh. oh my god. Which is a sentence of all time. Also, I'm 100% screwed. Uh, Smeargle is totally gonna be legal. NMP, I gotta head out and eat some food. Have a great one. Thank you so much, dude. Like, genuinely, you have no idea how much, like, how much this means to me. You have no idea. Yeah, that's what Chadot did in, like, the original. 
Like in, in, in Gen Gen 4. Like in Gen 4, people just taught chat out slurs. And it was like... It was... It was... You know... It was a thing. I don't... We don't we don't commend slurs here. <laughs> I I want to make it clear we don't commend slurs here. Slurs are kind of cringe. Oh. Uh. uh, I don't know, Zane. I don't know. When's the Smurgle with only legendary signature moves? gonna oh what's the best gen oh gen 5 gen 5 uh generation 5 is my favorite uh pokemon white is my favorite game of all time i love generation 5 uh i adore it and i forever will someone at game freak definitely got fired that day so true so true I've seen a video of chat uh, by band competitive band just because chatter and the mic function. Yeah, there you give people access to saying whatever they want on the internet, and someone is going to abuse that and say slurs. Unfortunately, I love Pokemon Black because it's my first Pokemon game. My first was Platinum, but my 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 beloved is one hundred percent. It's one hundred percent white. Pokemon White is my favorite game of all time. I love the music. I love the characters. I love the region. I love the Pokemon. I love the gameplay. I love the art style. Everything around Gen 5 is just so good. I love Gen 5. Though my second favorite is honestly Scarlet and Violet. Like, as as time has definitely, like, as time has gone on, I have accepted the fact that this game has big flaws. Big flaws. But... If the flaws were fixed, aka the performance, it's it's performance issues. If performance issues were fixed, I think this game would have been much more like re like received better, you know. But that's just me, obviously. Also, I'm very scared that I'm gonna lose this Iron Hands matchup. I very much ask this Iron Hands to stop hitting me. I think I do just enough. I think I do just enough to be able to... If I get a high roll next turn. If I get a high roll next turn, I think I will do just enough. Come on. High roll, high roll, high roll, high roll. High roll. Oh, Lord. My heart. My heart. My heart. Oh. Also, for everyone new here, I don't know if I did a proper introduction, but for all the lurkers or over on Big Yellow stream, um, my name is Hailstone. I'm a lumpfish VTuber. Uh, you can call me any pronouns, but I do prefer she, her. But y again, you can call me any. I'm not going to be offended. Um, I play Pokemon. Pokemon is my main shtick, but I do play other stuff. And, uh, we're so close to 1k followers on Twitch, so if you're enjoying what you're seeing so far, maybe consider dropping a follow, you know? Why'd you pick the username Hailstone? I, I actually did not come up with Hailstone. My, <laughs> thank you so much for the follow, Taka Time. Um, the reason why I'm called Hailstone is because my cousin came up with it back in the day uh because i wanted an ice theme name and he thought the name hailstone sounded cool because we were super into um we were super into team fortress 2 team fortress 2 is my favorite shooter of all time and we wanted something along the lines of something like saxton hail some like a name like that in hailstone and i wanted an ice theme and hailstone just came in his mind i'm like i like that and so i've been hailstone ever since gita is the worst champion hard agree hard agree 
I know Royal Bunny. I am my 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 heart just thinking about that is oh I'm so excited. I'm so excited. For the big meme rock and stone, but instead hail and stone, true. I need to get Pokemon Infinite Fusion. I still haven't. Saxton Hailstone, true. I wish I was as cool as I wish I was as cool as Saxon Hale. I, I hope it's better, T. I hope they're better than Gita. Okay. Torterra fucks their shit up. Like, in this team, from the looks of it, Torterra fucks their shit up. I, I need to play Infinite Fusions. I really need to. I think Diantha is not that bad of a champion simply because she uses Pokemon in her generation and not only that her music slaps if y'all have not heard Diantha's theme in forever you guys should totally like re-listen to it because that theme slaps Sinnoh starter team I mean I want to make an Infernape team. Infernape's my brother's favorite Pokemon. And I want to make a team based off Infer Infernape at some point. I wonder what it would look like if you fused Cubchoo with Beartech. That would be funny. I wonder if I would like Scarlet or Violet, to be honest. I mean, if you are if you're the type of person that looked over like looks over performance issues because for me like i i'm the type of person that will look over performance issues if it means i like the game um but i i would say if you're into open the like the concept of open world like i grew up playing pixelmon for so for me i was super excited about this idea but if that's something that intrigues you, I'd say maybe if you could find it pre-owned, it's it, it wouldn't be a bad like investment to look into. Yeah, secondhand, it's not bad. Should have changed her Gardevoir with Gallade. I don't know if that breaks the rules and stuff. Uh, Mega Gallade wasn't until Oraz, so that's probably the main thing. That and like her design is very much, it's very much Mega Gardevoir. But I see what you're saying. I do see what you're saying. Who is better, Leon or Cynthia? Cynthia, hand it down. Arceus is a phenomenal game. Legends Arceus, I love. I, I love, I love Legends Arceus. Highly recommend that one. Like, I would honestly say, like, Legends Arceus would probably be a better investment to Scarlet and Violet, personally. No! I needed them to live! Shit! Oh! That's fine. That's, that's fine. If Legends Arceus is so good, why isn't there a Legends Arceus 2? I'd kill for a Legends Arceus 2. You have no idea. Or a Legends Curem. If if I have to get dog shit black and white remakes to get a Legends Curem game, I I I I'd take it. I'd take it. If it means I get a like Larry is the best gym leader, my favorite's Bryson. I'm a huge Bryson guy myself. I get the Larry appeal, though. He's easily top five. Like, easily top five. I got another good team idea. A Cyclozar, Coridon, and Maridon team with any Pokemon as support. I mean, you know, throwing Coridon or Maridon on a team is definitely going to make it a good team. At least, like, you know, stat-wise, like, 100%, it, will, it definitely will. Now it's very much, I gotta get rid of Landorus. I think Heavy Slam's my best bet. I don't know how heavy Landorus is, but we'll try. <laughs> I 
Sounds good, Shulk. Sounds good, man. I also love how he taunted me twice. <coughs> Thank you for the follow. Thank you very much. It's a theme team because Coridon evolves into Cyclozar over time and Maridon is uh, future Cyclozar. E. Well, uh, did y'all know, um, uh, I think, like, the Paradox name for Coridon, if I remember correctly, is, like, Crowned King or something like that. It's something king. We just, it's a phenomenal paradox. Winged King, that's the name. Thank you. It's a phenomenal name. Like, it is a phenomenal name. Like, that is valid. I, I'm very excited. Stream is dying. Is it? Everyone on YouTube, is you is the stream dying for you guys? Everyone on YouTube's end, uh, is everything good for you guys? Because uh, my OBS it looks good. I don't see any issues with OBS for once. Winged King sounds like a Buffalo <laughs> Wing restaurant. It does sound funny, to be fair. But chat, everyone over on YouTube, is everything good? Uh, peeps, can someone check YouTube's end? Is the YouTube end dying? If Coridon and Maridon are legendaries, does that make mean Cyclozar is also a legendary? I see it as Coridon is like the, you know, the ancestor. Like, there's only one. He's the ancestor. And how it turns into is that in the future, Cyclozar becomes common, but then uh, eventually becomes extinct, be leaving Maridon. That's how I see it. Maridon's also cool. It's Iron Serpent. Yee, that's pretty badass. That's pretty cool. That is pretty cool, to be fair. YouTube side is fine. Thank you for checking, Roddy. Also, are you still not a mod on YouTube? Hold on. Here. I don't know why you weren't a mod, Roddy. You're now mod. I don't, I don't understand why you didn't have mod already, but you're good now. <laughs> Losing Iron Hands is definitely going to suck. Live. <gasps> Heat Wave. That's fine. That's fine. I lose Torterra. That, that, that's fine. That's fine. That's fine. That's fine. That'd be cool. That'd be cool, T. I think you could probably make it work. The thing I like about most about modern Pokemon is to give old Pokemon new forms. Oh, yeah, I agree. Welcome back, Mama. I very much agree with you there. I think it's a very cool thing that modern Pokemon does. I did not know, Zane. Hmm. Ooh, the double protect failed. Let's go. I mean, Tyranitar. Damn, imagine, Roddy. Tyranitar is better now, T, since it does get, um, what's it called? Um, what's the move? 
What's the move I'm thinking of? Brain, 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 work please. Uh, knock off. That's the, that's the name of the move. Knock off. Thank you. Knock off is the name. <laughs> knock off is the move I'm thinking of. I'm silly. Ignore the fact I'm a little goofy, chat. Live? Fuck. No, of course it was a crit! Of course it was a crit! Oh no. It's Cresselia Heatran. Fuck. Uh, it's because the it's the opponent that's slowest is the one T. That's why. The slowest weather setting Pokemon is always gonna be the one that gets set up. So don't put Tyranitar in lead is the best way. You want to have... Make sand an option. Make sand an option. Don't make it just a full sand team. That's the best way to do it. Definitely make it an option, but don't make it primarily sand. Like, say, like, uh, a, a good sand team that happened recently was uh, people have used Houndstone. There's been experimentation with Houndstone recently. como -O with Overcoat is a pretty solid Sandstorm Pokemon. Uh, does help with, like, Sash and all of that. Hi, Songo. Other options is, obviously, if you want to do Empoleon, you could. Like... Make sand an option, but not the full center of your team. You want it to be something that's flexible. I regret looking at my Twitch homepage. Let me guess. Uh, body painters. Let me guess. You saw body painters. Yeah, body, body painters do be a thing. Yeah, I've seen, um, I've seen Stored Power Cresselia. Stored Power Cresselia is pretty cool. It does mean you're sacrificing, like, a few moves to make it work, but it is pretty cool. It's fine. No big deal. Shulk, you ready? We'll take a quick break and do a viewer battle. Remember, we're only doing best of one today. What are we doing? Singles, doubles? What do you feel like, champ? Three, six, three, six, nine, eight, nine, eight. If I can spell correctly. Singles all six. You got it, Chief. Mew have a build with bo with body press, stored power, and cosmic power. Oh, God. That sounds horrifying. May hopefully one day, T, I want there to be a male combi counterpart. Like, I really do, and I do hope one day we get it. I really do hope one day we get it. Just because of the fact that, like, male Combi needs something. Colonel, there are 90 children here. I will victory royale them now. Was was that was that uh was that good song though? Did I did I do it correctly? No problem, no problem. Glad I could help. I mean, I also want something for male Solandit, since, you know, I got some male Solandits that just can't evolve. It'd be nice if they could. I'm just saying. I'm just saying it'd be nice. 
be nice. Hmm. I need some special attackers. That's physical. I need some special attackers. I'm trying to think of Pokemon I haven't used in a while. I haven't used you in forever. Let's bring L to O. That was unfortunately patched out. I have seen that glitch before. And unfortunately, it doesn't work anymore. I Trust me. I have very much looked into it. Because I did get a couple males to land it. While shiny hunting. Take care, mama. I have looked into it before. And unfortunately, it doesn't, it doesn't work out. They did patch it. Do you think we need a triple type Pokemon? I think Terrastalization should be the closest we get to triple types. Or if they do want to do something with triple types, I think it should be an ability similar to like Steamworker where you get the stab bonus. I don't think they should do like an actual triple type Pokemon. Um, at least in my opinion. True, that'd be really rad, Ben. Like, tr I think once you get to triple typing, I think that does become a bit of an, like, a, a little bit of an, like, a, a bit of a balance issue is the best way to put it. I think Songo put it best, that it does become a little bit of an issue. They did fix it in Sword. If a fusion of Rapid Strike, Urshifu, and Single Strike, Urshifu would work. A water, dark, and fighting type? I, I just don't want to think of that ever happening, to be honest. That sounds... I already have to deal with two of them. Them being combined sounds absolutely horrifying. And to me... Um, yeah, I just, I just don't want to deal with that. To me, that don't sound fun, is what I'm saying. I think make, making, like, abilities that give, like, stab bonuses, though, are fine. I think that's fine. I think that's a good way to do, like, a triple-type concept. I definitely think once you get to the point where you're actually doing, like, multiple stuff. Um. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, Urshifu's already a problem in general, so. The main thing about Urshifu is its fucking ability, alright? The move is one thing. Like, you can deal with its move fine. There already technically already exist moves that do similar things, like the guaranteed crits. Like, <laughs> like it's fine. But the main issue is, abil is its ability. Just literally make it so you do like one eighth of the damage. Just make it so it does one eighth. It should never, like ever, there should never be an ability that just straight up ignores protect. Like never. There never should be an ability where it just says no to your one defensive option. I think that's cringe. And I think Urshifu is cringe. Like, hi like a move that ignores Protect is fine. Like, that's fine. Because Faint has existed for years, but no one complains about Faint for obvious reasons. You know? I mean, Arceus is funny because he is supposed to be like God, but he's like a goat. They should totally give Arceus a new form. Like an origin form or something like that. That'd be cool. I 
mean, I disagree because I think the Teal Mask legendaries are actually really solidly balanced. They're strong. Like, okay, I say they're strong. Ogapon's strong. But they're not meta-defining. They're not meta-defining. That's the thing you have to think. Meta-defying is when the majority like the majority are using this pokemon because of its busted aspect ogapon i think is interesting because ogapon's at like i believe most tournaments it's like a 26 percent usage that's healthy i think there's nothing wrong with like ogapon like obviously you ha like it runs a lot of similar sets but because its move pool is huge and as four forms, you can run it different aspects. And I do think that's really cool. Like, Ogapon isn't overwhelming. Is Like, it's not an overwhelming Pokemon. Urshifu is an overwhelming Pokemon. And that's why Urshifu cringe. He's a llama? I can see it. Just give Arceus the legend play? They should. I genuinely think they should because you can't even use it like... You can't use Arceus in competitive. Unless they have plans on finally letting Arceus being usable. Because, you know, Legends Arceus. Which I'd, I think would be cool. It would be silly, but it'd be cool. Um, But yeah. Uh, th those are my thoughts on Urshifu and why I think, honestly, Ogapon. He still technically is. They let Arceus be used in Gen 8. Gen 8, Ar Arceus was not in Gen 8. You can't use Arceus in Gen 8. No, you Arceus isn't in Gen 8. Like, he's, he's not in Gen 8. <laughs> He was only a Legends Arceus. He's not in Sword and Shield. I would have known. I would have seen Arceus's during the, the, the mythical season, which, God, I thought that was going to be awesome. And then we remembered, oh, yeah, Magirna exists. And that was a mistake. But, yeah, no. Uh, he was never usable in... Um, Sword and Shield. Well, yeah, they allowed Mythicals at the end, but no one liked it. <laughs> I have legit never seen so many people literally play a fan format over the official in so long. No one played the Mythical format. Everyone played Spike Myth Cup. Which was so funny. I played Spike Myth Cup. That shit was super fun. That shit was awesome. I mean, fair enough, T. I'm just always going to be on the side that I think uh, Urshifu's cringe. What's the worst mythical Pokemon? Zarud. Y'all remember Zarud? Because I don't. I remember it simply because I'm a Pokemon guy. It's my job to remember Pokemon. Zarud is a Pokemon of all time. Did you get the daddy form? Yeah, I got the delta form. I love how you called it daddy form. That's funny. I do have it. Um, I got I got both the delta and the uh, uh, first forms of Zarud. And Zarud is a Pokemon that exists. And I think that's the best you're going to get out of Zarud. It's a mythical Pokemon. I'd say just gen it in. For me, I, I don't see an issue with genning. Uh, I don't see an issue with genning mythicals, to be honest. So I'd say gen it. GG, Shulk. 
Zara Aura got the Unite treatment. Yeah, that's why I say Zara, not Zara Aura, because I remember Zara Aura because of Unite. Zarud just literally came into existence, and then they said, okay, nah, we're good now. We're good. Yeah, Zarud just, um, is, is a Pokemon. Melmetal is so cool. I love Melmetal. Thank you for the follow. Welcome, welcome. I think Melmetal is badass. Melmetal is so cool. I love him. Like, he's such a cool guy. And I hope that, like, he's usable again in the DLC. If not, it's fine. I can trance... Uh, I've not seen anything, and I'm actually really curious because there actually hasn't even been talk if every legendary is coming back, which is a genuine shock to me. I put money on every legendary coming back, but we haven't heard anything, and that makes me very curious. Extremely, like, it's 50-50 on the legendaries come back or not, and... I find that extremely curious simply because of the fact that like this would be the first time not every legendary is usable in a restricted format and I don't know that that's just kind of neat I don't know I just it's it's just neat I don't dislike it I think it's a it's a bold choice I think it's extremely bold like extremely bold but I respect it. If that's the case they're going, I respect it. My only request is the Tapus come back. Ultra Necrozma suddenly returning. Oh, please. Yeah, all the Reggies coming back. That That's understandable. It makes sense. We already have the other two. It'd be silly if they didn't. I just want the Tapus to come back. Hi, Pluty. Give me one quick second. I'll go get a go get my drink. I have some cranberry juice in my my fridge. I'm sneezing so hard I keep pissing myself. It's tr tr tragic. How's the pot my poggers fish doing? I'm doing not too bad, Pluty. Not too bad. Hey, Creamy. Uh, it's currently uh, noon time for me. How you doing? Detect? Really? Also, I don't know how I got home. I mean, I'm I'm glad you're home. I'm glad. Also, Pluty, I saw your tweet. You you realize that like. You, you realize that, like, f human hails four foot seven. That's, that doesn't equate to Vore unless you're, like, I don't know, like, 60 feet tall. I'm, ju I'm just saying. You don't know how tall I am? I mean, that's fair. Also, fun, fun, Creamy. Origin Palkia and Origin Dialga look like two horses with long neck spikes. They do, and that's funny. I can be as tall as God wants me to be. Fair enough, Pluty. I'm taller now when, I, uh, when I'm in human form, yes. When I'm in mermaid form, no. I need to get... Um... I need to get the, the, uh, fuck, words. Words are hard, chat. Words hurt my head. Oh, your belly drum. Oh, I don't like that. Good question, Creamy. My brain kind of hurts, so I'm not sure, but so true. I need to get shiny Tapufini still. That's the shiny I want. It, 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 it's huntable in 
uh, sword and shield. You can hunt it there. Um, no, it's n you can't get the shiny. Shiny is still unattainable at the moment. Oh, I thought it was going to go for, like, detect. That's why I didn't double in. I didn't know if it was or not. It doesn't have a spread move, so it'll have to go for one. Iron Hands? That's fine. Uh, that means I go for Shadow Ball next turn. Hell yeah, Creamy. Hell yeah. Also, fair enough, Plutie. That's funny. That funny. I am very funny. True. So true. Fuck. I mean, not really. I found it kind of cool because then it finally meant people would stop saying like, oh, legendaries can't evolve, you know? Because that was like a weird thing the internet always hyper fixated on for so long was like, oh, legendaries, they, they can't evolve. That's what makes them legendary. It was a weird thing. It was very weird. Ooh, 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 ooh. That's, my, that's the only ooh, ooh you're getting out of me today. Evolve into these nuts. Don't know. I don't think I will. All right, full health iron hands. Let's go, chief. Hail food question. Is the Wendy's menu good? Yes. Wendy's is my go-to fast food. I think Wendy's is neat. How you doing, Arya? How you doing? Take your time, Creamy. Your opinion is invalid. The FBI is coming for you. What did I do? Get the wet baked potato. True. Okay, good. Your honor, I... S oh my god, I managed to outspeed the alcohol. Wait, what? Huh? Jesse? Jesse, what the fuck? Pluty, is there something you're not telling us? Also, this is unfortunately a, um, a rip moment. Huh? Jesse? I don't think Plutie's stu that stupid, Arya. I, I think Plutie is actually a smart enough individual. Uh, so... So, are you home, Plute? I'm gonna hope you're home. I'm gonna hope you're home right now. Okay. Uh, next time, Pluty, please call someone to grab you. That's all I ask. Also, welcome back, Mama. Um, maybe. Maybe, T. I have a few Pokemon, like, stream ideas in my mind that I still need to do. I just haven't done yet. Also, this guy's cooking. Chi Yu, Brilloom, Rotom Wash, Dachbon, Fluttermane, and Dragonite. Okay. Chi Yu, Dachbon is honestly a really solid lead for them. I mean, Pluty, worst case scenario, call a friend. Don't ever, like, literally don't ever drive. Like, chat, drinking and driving, kind of cringe. I'm in math class now. Fun, fun. 
Drinking and driving is extremely cringe. Don't, don't do it. Hmm. What's my game plan here? Do I go Arcanine? I think I go Arcanine. But we're allowed to drive drunk in our country? What the fuck? What the fuck? What? Huh? Jesse? What? That's so dumb. What? That, that is extremely dumb. Man, America did something right for once. What the fuck? Each team is allowed one legendary. That's not in Paldea region. You can be singles or doubles. Noted, noted. Noted. That still is extremely stupid sounding, Plutie. I won't lie. Hey, I'll eat the goldfish. It's literally made out of fire, bro. Sir, that is a fire goldfish. Nice. 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 We take those. Yeah, that's extremely cringe. Uh, I am extremely against drunk driving. I think it is the worst thing you can do. Like, genuinely. Get Hellstone to eat the firefish? True. Pokemon Scarlet and Violet were easy to beat. Oh, they were very easy to beat. They were extremely fun, though. For me, difficulty doesn't equal fun to me. It, like, I don't, like... Obviously, I don't mind difficult games. I really don't. But for me, I'm not the type of person where, like, I want Dark Soul level difficulty or this game ain't fun. Yo, thank you for the five. This isn't League of Legends. <laughs> Come on, it's time to play some League with your favorite brother-in-law. Alex, I'm not playing League, man. All right, that was for 900. All right, if you if you do a bachelor's party at some point and you ask for League, then sure, but only then. How you doing, man? It's time to play League, but I'm not playing League. I'm not playing League, man. Uh, imagine playing Dark Souls Pokemon. Imagine. Hey, I'll play League with me. No, no chat. I'm not playing League of Legends. I'll be the support and abuse you mentally. Oh, God. Uh. Fair enough, T. Fair enough. If you remind me at some point. Uh, I could probably look into doing that at some point. Fuck League. Play Unite with me. I need... To, I, I'm going to be playing Unite soon since they're doing Twitch drops. Which is actually kind of based. Pokemon Unite. Pokemon League of Legends, Alex. So if we unfollow until you're under 900, then refollow. Would you play League? No. I'm not doing that. Uh. Also sit straight up Your back's gonna hurt My chair is dog shit My chair is actual ass dude You've seen it It's bad Yeah T At some point I'm gonna be streaming Unite again Because they're doing Twitch drops What's your favorite starter? Decidueye Either form I love both of them I think either Decidueye form is valid 
It's literally held together with thoughts and prayers, my dude. My chair is actual fucking ass. Oh, my lord. I'm gonna have to risk the burn. I <laughs> see you, Alex. But yeah, Zozane, my favorite starter is uh, Decidueye. I love Decidueye. Oh, thank God I didn't go for the fake out. How about a full team of Eevee? I've done full Eevee teams in Unite. That shit's funny. Someone just called Symbiote Spider-Man Venom, and I've never felt so much pain in my life. Technically, they're not wrong. Because it's the Venom Symbiote, so they're not technically wrong. <laughs> technically, they're not wrong. Alright, so now know what this is about. I'm gonna Terra Water, I'm hitting you with a Shadow Ball. Speaking of Venom, Ao. Only 20 more followers, Hail. Wait, are we seriously at two at 980 right now? Wait, chat, are we at 980 followers? Wait, 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 wait. Oh my god, we're at 980. Chat, if you guys aren't following already, please consider do dropping a follow. Oh my god. Please do consider dropping a follow. We're getting so close. Holy shit. Holy shit. Flareon's the worst evolution. Fair enough. My I don't have a least favorite evolution. I think all of them are good. My brother is a huge Flareon fan. Though my favorite evolution is Sylveon. Who the fuck trying to fight right now? You would have to go to my YouTube chat to fight Arya if you wanted to. <laughs> oh my god. You'd have to go over to my YouTube chat. But chat, genuinely thank you so much. Like, honest to god, to all the people who followed this stream and are currently just watching. Or first time lurkers even. Like, seriously. Just genuinely thank you so much. We're so close to 1k. And don't worry, guys. Remember that promise I made a long time ago about wearing a specific outfit? I'm still keeping that promise. That promise is still in play here. <laughs> Arya straight up pulled up the fucking YouTube chat. <laughs> That's funny. Oh, that's funny. My fa my favorite Sylveon. I mean, trans rights are pretty cool, you know? <laughs> Chat, I don't know if y'all know this. Trans rights are kind of poggers. Oh, my lord. Hey guys, did you know I believe in human rights for everyone? Oh. <laughs> so true, Arya. So true. Oh my god. The main thing like i'm just extremely grateful for is just honestly just everyone like i'm i'm so thankful for everyone who has supported me over like this entire time i've been doing twitch just generally thank you so much like there there's no other way to put it i'm just super just thankful i know it's gone but that doesn't mean i shouldn't just be thankful I'm thankful on other days of the year. 
<laughs> it's not, it's not just. I, I, I genuinely am just grateful for everyone who's followed, for everyone who's watched my stuff. Take care, mama. Um, just everything, honestly. I'm just thankful for literally everything. Just thanks. Thanks for watching my stuff, even for like five minutes. It, it means the world to me, genuinely. Like, I love doing Twitch as a hobby. Th this is my favorite thing to do. I look forward to it every time, like... I boot up my computer. I love chatting with you guys. I love meeting new people. I love having these in-depth discussions with games and Pokemon and all of this. I am, I am just, yeah, just thanks. <laughs> I, I, I genuinely mean it. Also, if you guys um, wouldn't mind helping share my stream, thank you for the head pads, Wyatt. If you guys wouldn't mind like sharing my stream, it'd also be appreciated since we are so close. We are 20. You son of a fucking bitch. Uh, <laughs> we're so close to 1K. We are so close. Hmm. Shit, what do I do here? I really need Goldingo. No chat, you do not you do not get to throw car batteries. Hmm. I'm minus two, right? I'm minus one. Let me swap in bundle. I know what I can do here. I'm literally just delaying till this terrain's gone. Once Garat grassy terrain is gone, it means that we're able to just go for the moves we want to go for. We're playing the long game right now. I mean, I don't mind if starters stand up straight. I really don't. I love Meow Scarada. Meow Scarada is easily top five starters for me. For me, Decidueye, both forms I count as one. Number one. Number two is Primarina. Number three is Torterra. Number four is Incineroar. And number five is Meow Scarada. Meowskarada mid. Alright, bad opinion alert. Sorry you have shit opinions. Yeah, yours. Chat, if you like Meowskarada, put a one in the chat. If you don't, put two. I'm not saying it's your favorite. I'm asking if you like it. There's a difference. Aria, no spamming. All right, that's a one. Overwhelmingly twos. Yeah, you're dumb. Depends. We're talking about as a Pokemon. If you uh, if you ask for any other reasons, you're silly. Okay, we can do this. This is very much doable. Watch this shit, chat. Watch this shit. 
They got Tailwind up. Oh, that's unfortunate. Anyway. I got Iron Bundle. Fun fact, chat. Iron Bundle outspeeds majority of Pokemon, even in Tailwind. As long as it's Timid Booster, it will outspeed most of them. Which that sentence alone is really funny. Oh no! Iron Bundle! Iron Bundle's attack stats going down! Oh no! Tragic! Oh, they're totally gonna bring back... Oh, they're gonna bring back Rillaboom after the terrain ends! Oh, I gotta go through all that shit again. Um, that's fine. That's fine. You know what? That's fine. I can sack off Gold Dango at this point. Tailwind, Tailwind. Yeah, I can sack off Gold Dango at this point. Actually, wait, hold on. Effective, effect. Okay, it's neutral. Neutral. I can sack off Gold Dango at this point. I need to know if that thing's running grassy. Like, uh, grassy. Um. Grassy Glide as well. I need to know what the Ogre Pond's grass move is. Fuck! It's double Grassy Glide? Shit. Alright, that's actually a big issue. Um... Fuck, that's huge. Okay. Hmm. What's the best Ash team? Uh, best Ash team, in my opinion, is probably... Yes! Good call! Alright, you know, we have a chance. Uh, best Ash team is probably his Kalos team. I'm a big fan of the Kalos anime. Also, hey, Fox, how you doing? Big issue. I'm a big issue. Valid. Lamau. Oh, okay. This is going to be... Speaking of big issues, this is going to be a big issue. I'm literally just trying to stall out the grassy terrain. That is what it's just mostly coming down to, is I need to stall the grassy terrain as much as I can. Because they are going to double into Iron Bundle as soon as it's gone. Like, legit, as soon as I get the opening, they're, they're doubling into them. That's fine. I think... We'll see. Keyword is we'll see. Mm. Just hoping for the best for Iron Bundle. Fuck. Alright, Iron Hands, I need you to start doing crits. Yeah, no, we lost. Fuck, man, that sucks. That sucks. That's tragic. Yeah, that sucks. It is what it is. It's just unfortunate.
Because there's no way we win this now. They did call the protect, which if we did call the bluff, we would have been fine, but you know. Uh, Lucky, I don't know if you know this, Dracovish was literally one of the most powerful Pokemon in Sword and Shield. It got banned to Ubers and in VGC before a lot of other Pokemon came out. It was actually like, I think at a top five, like Dracovish is actually an extremely strong Pokemon. Like, Surfetch, take it or leave it. Dracovish, unironically, was a monster. There's a reason why we call him Mr. Fish. There's a reason why we call him Mr. Fish. <laughs> okay. Torkoal, Armor Rouge, Iron Hand. Okay, this is... Mm, I don't want to use... I don't want to use Trick Room in this team, but I also, I just don't like Dracovish. Dracovish is funny. I love the Gen 8 fossils so much. I love their concept that they're literally just abominations. That they're literally just fucking thrown together. And they're just like struggling to live. Like, th that's funny. They are just these abominations that have just never should have been alive. And yet they are. They're they're great. I, I think they're fantastic. There's a good chance they start in DD Armor Rouge. And I'm gonna do this just in case they do. I I just think they're funny. That's why I don't like them. Yeah, and that's why I love them. <laughs> They just look like they're in pain. They're just little guys that are struggling to live. Okay, Iron Hands, Armor Rouge. This can go one of two ways. <laughs> and one way scares me. Because I very much feel like Arm Rouge is the Trick Room setter. But the question is, does he go for Trick Room turn one? I think he does. I think he's gonna go for Trick Room turn one. In indoor. What? 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 Huh? What? Weakness po- oh, he's weakness policy. He's weakness policy. That's what it is. I was like, what the fuck? I'm like, oh, it's- It's weakness. Okay. I know what it is now. Get out of here, that gimmicky shit. I was like, what? I'm like, oh, right. Yeah, weakness policy. Duh. Get out of here with this gimmick. What are you going for? 
Terra Psychic. Okay, you are just spamming expanding force. That's fun. You're cool. You're so awesome. Expanding force is a move of all time. Shiny and Dee is adorable. Oh, it is. It's a very cute Pokemon. Great. Awesome. Sick. Whoop, that's GG. That is very much a GG moment. There's nothing I can do there. Because that indeed is clicking follow me and there's nothing I can do. Literally nothing I can do. It's clicking follow me. This guy's awesome. I'm lying, by the way. <laughs> Cool. That was fun. Armor Rouge is such a quirky Pokemon. Oof is a big oof. How you doing? How you doing, Talk? Arm Armor Rouge is very quirky, uh, very silly. Uh, expanding force is very, um, is very silly. Very silly. We have an oof jar. Uh, yes, because that's an in that's like an entire inside joke. That has been a thing for fucking years since like 2018. I've had that, and it will forever exist. I'm never getting rid of it. The oof jar is eternal. Oh? What was your weird breakfast experiment? What were, what were you tinkering? Tink, tinkering? I can speak words. I know how to... I know how to speak. What were you tinkering with? I swear I know how to speak, chat. I swear. Ignore the fact that I don't know how to speak. What is this? Oh, what is this guy cooking? Oh, this guy's cooking. Hello? Hmm. I haven't seen Toxapex in forever. Uh, this team looks like something that Torterra would love to say hello to. Torterra would absolutely love to say hello. Toxapex used to be my boy? Really? You were a Toxapex fan? Damn. You learn something new every day. I'm worried. There is one thing I'm worried about with this, though. That and the lizard lady in the 2v2 battle format? That makes sense. Yeah, Salazzle is very much a you Pokemon. I can see it. Yesterday, I made fish with rice. Some salad and beef flavoring. Ooh, nice. That sounds delicious, my dude. I didn't eat breakfast this morning, so to be fair, anything sounds delicious to me. <laughs> and before chat gets on my ass about it, I will eat as soon as I go to work, all right? I already know I'm going to have people saying stuff if I don't. That was the only time baby me ever tried to cook in Pokemon. I mean, to be fair, it was cooking. To be fair, you were cooking there. 
and I respect the cooking. I'm worried about Ursaluna. Ursaluna scares the shit out of me. Ursaluna genuinely scares me. Didn't go for protect. I thought that's what it was gonna do. Earth power? Thank god I predicted that shit. Thank god I predicted that shit. Alright, do not Terra. Do not Terra. Do not click the Terra button. Do not. Do not click it. You did not click it round one. All right. Don't click it. Do anything but click the Tara button. You are my favorite person ever. Also stupid. Okay, thank God. I don't have to deal with Ursa Luna. I don't have to deal with Brook, pissed off Brook. Heat wave? I mean, that's fine. I rather, I honest, yeah, I rather be poisoned than burnt, to be honest. Cause I mean, I can just go for Lunar Blessing. Yeah, I can just go for Lunar Blessing. That actually does like nothing to me. Man, Cresselia is such a funny Pokemon. Sneasler, oh boy. Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. I feel like I don't even have to worry about Pheasantipity. Like, I'm looking at it. I'm like, do I really have to worry about this thing? I don't think I do. My sister is calling me on my phone. Give me a sec, chat. Sorry about that, Chad. I got a call from my sister. Apparently, I was not told this. Uh, my mom apparently just went into the hospital today. Um, so that's uh, fun. Uh, I was literally just told down the phone. That's cool. Um, I'm just gonna. I'm just gonna hope it's because of her standard condition. For those who are unaware, my mom has a condition called uh, Complex Regional Pain Syndrome. She does go to the hospital quite a bit because of it. And I'm going to hope it's because of that. Because if it's because of that, she's like, it's it's nothing too bad. I Because uh, she does go in every few months for it. But I was not told that she was going in now is like the thing. Um. So again... Fingers crossed on it's just that. Um, I pretty much just told my sister to keep me on standby. And if I have, obviously, if I have to leave stream early, I will. Because obviously, family before anything else. Um, that's just uh, not something I like getting a call over. Uh, so, yeah. Oh, boy. Oh boy, oh boy. Back, are you winning? Uh, maybe. I don't know yet, to be fair. I don't know yet.
I don't know. We're gonna see, though. I have a feeling that Sneasler is gonna go for Terra Flying, which is the reason why I'm swapping. Because that Sneasler clicks Terra Flying, I'm kind of waiting to see what their Terra is. Are they Terraing Moltres and that Terra Poison, or are they Terraing Sneasler to be Terra Flying? Terra Dark. Oh shit, they just want damage. That actually works out for me in the fact that um, I can now actually hit them for a neutral, which is fine. That's actually huge. Um, and they should take out Sneasler. Yes. Uh, that might activate weakness if this thing's weakness. Probably, maybe. Okay, it's the nasty plot set. Um. Okay. Nasty plot. I'll go for Trick Room. All right, Berserk's going to activate. Burn is huge. Burn is huge. I'm trying to go with the idea that there's a good chance it will have to be down to Torterra. Fuck. Oh, I should have helping hand. I should have just went with my gut. I should have just went with my gut. Fuck. Well, it's definitely going to be down to Torterra. That's for sure. It's just down to if Torterra lives, which good chance. Uh, no. Gaming, so true. How you doing, Rebecca? Owie. That sucks. Oh, we just went back down to eight. I just remembered. Fuck. Also, I'm glad to hear, but fuck. Uh, chat, we probably will do like one more and then I might just stand on standby just because of my mom. Just get better. So true. That's probably what I'm going to end up doing, Chad. I apologize, but uh, I'd rather be on standby because of my mom. So we'll probably just do one more. We were doing so good in the beginning, and then all of a sudden we've been on a losing streak. So I definitely think this will be our last battle, and then we'll probably... I'll probably just wait on standby to make sure my mom's okay. Because I'm probably going to give her a call and make sure everything's good. I'm hoping everything's good. I'm hoping it's just... Standard, uh, what does wait on standby mean? My mom got went to the hospital and I'm not told what yet. I've not gotten, I've not gotten a call from my brother or my dad yet. Um, so I don't know if it's because of her condition flaring up or for other reasons. So I am waiting to see what I need to do pretty much. Um... So this will definitely be the last battle. Um, this is a great lead for us. It's Okie Dogi, uh, Sinistra, Thunderous, Landorus, Azumarill, Heatran. Literally, there's no reason to not start Iron Bundle. There's like actually no fucking reason not to. This team reeks of if I just click freeze dry, you're going to die. Um, which I've been saying that about a few other time, times, so, but so we'll have to see, but you know. Uh, that was my Palafin team for a while. Uh, I need to update it just to be back to what it used to be. You get fake out. I know that. I know Okie Dogi gets fake out, which Okie Dogi is still the funniest fucking name, and I refuse to say otherwise. Um, so I'm going to protect. I'm going to go for a fake out. Because I'm generally curious as to what set this thing is. Okie dokie does not hurt us. 
also 100% that thing's guard dog. If it's lead, it's guard dog. Oh, perfect. All right, are you covert? You're covert. All right, you're covert cloak. Yep. You're covert cloak. Noted. You're support covert. Um, I lose my booster, but that's fine. I still outspeed most things naturally. I don't want to swap in simply because um, that thing's guard dog. It's not like defiant, but like it still makes it immune. And I want to make sure that we're good. Bulk up? All right. I already know. Uh, bulk up, drain punch, poison jab, uh, protect. It's it's want it's wanna be annihilate, pretty much. It's wanna be annihilate. That's pretty much what the set is. Good news is that Okie Dogie, I shit you not, literally has nothing to hit Goldango. Goldango gets the set up for free. And it can't do shit. It straight up cannot do shit. It does nothing. Goldango's gonna eat the hits. We're gonna go for for make it rain. And we're going to we're gonna take out the Okie Dogie. Because there's legit nothing that Okie Dogie can do against Goldango. It's immune to both its stabs. And if it's the bulk upset, it's running both those stabs. It's literally just done to Thunderous. Just being nice. And leaving us alone for like two seconds. Gold Dango is such an awesome Pokemon. Gold Dango is so quirky. It has such a busted ability, but man, he's so quirky. He's so silly. I love him. I love him. He's so funny. He's so quirky. My dude is one of the most fucking broken abilities, if not the most one of... Well, just... It's, it's top five most broken abilities ever made, and it's so quirky. I love him. If you love him so much, marry him? No, lol. Also, you went for Terra Water against an Iron Hands. Sir, you're kind of silly. You're kind of being goofy. Because here's the thing. He can't hurt Goldengo. He can't. He straight up can't hurt Goldengo. Nothing he can do can hurt Goldengo. Very silly. He's such. He's so silly. He's so goofy. Kind of quirky. Okay, Landorus very much gonna hurt Goldango. I can fucking tell you that much. He resists steel. He doesn't resist ghost. I literally... I literally... Mention, it's fine. It's fine. It's fine. He doesn't have a signature move. He doesn't have a signature move. Oh! Oh! So, Hale, how was fun was Chucky? I haven't played him yet. Well, would you look at that? Well, would you look at that? He has a signature ability. Oh, you're talking about Goldengo. Uh, yeah, no, make it rain. He very much resists. I thought you were talking about Okie Dogie for a second. That's my bad.
Yeah, he resists the signature move, but luckily, you know, I'm also ghost type, so. You son of a bitch! Um. I have Iron Hands in the back, right? Yeah, I do. Yeah, we're still fine. Yeah, we're still fine. Oh, wait, that was resisted. Oh, wait, we're more than fine. Wait a moment, we're more than fine. Hold on. Yeah, we're more than fine, actually. Take care, Rebecca. Sinistra? Oh, yeah, we're fine. We're fine. We're fine. We're fine. We're fine. We're golden. We're good as gold, some would say. I'm going to predict the protect. I'm going to predict. Yep. Okay. There it is. Gold Dango being paralyzed sucks because I'm pretty sure that doesn't mean Sinistra does outspeed. Matcha gotcha. Don't hurt as much as I think you will. You hurt more than I wanted to. You do. You son of a bitch. Don't burn. Just don't burn. Don't burn and I'll be happy. Okay, no burn. That's fine. Um, Alright, Iron Bundle. No! Rage Powder! Fuck! Oh, that genuinely sucks. That genuinely sucks. That genuinely sucks. What, are you Lumberry? Oh, you're Citrus. That genuinely sucks. Yeah, that's GG. That's GG. That's tragic. Listen, I love Iron Bundle. There's no way we're bringing that back. The boosts were just... We fucked ourselves over giving this guy boosts. It is what it is. We'll hopefully get him next time. That's fine. Yeah. Um, okay. With that being said, chat, I'm going to call it good here. I normally do go on for longer, but because, you know, hearing the news that my mom's in the hospital, I'm a little more worried than that. Uh, tomorrow, I'm not sure when we're streaming. We are going to stream tomorrow. Uh, I'm not gonna worry about a raid today, but thank you all so much for watching. If you did enjoy, please do consider dropping a follow on either YouTube or uh, or on Twitch or subscribing on YouTube. It would be appreciated. I hope everyone does have a fantastic day. Take it easy, everyone.